Hey, what's going on guys? Thanks for checking out today's video. Today we have a little recap here of an EWU, Elite Warriors United War, where we did a 10v10 against Croatian Army. Now, these are single hit format wars against um, competitive clans. So, here's the details. We won three triples to two, and we both had a one star on each side. So, let's go ahead and take a look at the first hit. Um, I managed to triple the number one. Let's go ahead and watch this. Uh, Pekka Smash. Pretty uh, pretty trendy attack at this point in the game. <laughs> uh, I decided to ward and walk over here because I liked the value of trying to snipe off that Inferno Tower. So here we go. Coco Loon to draw any traps. Drew two Teslas. Warden's going to go ahead and move in. I dropped the healers. A uh, baby to help make sure that Warden doesn't go way out there to get that um, gold mine. So now he's going to work his way in. I believe the next thing he hits is the um, elixir. And now he's going to move in and get the hut and the inferno. There he goes. We're going to go ahead and come up here. The king for the funnel at the top. And then start dropping in the P.E.K.K.A.s a little bit here and there just to make sure that funnel goes down relatively quickly. Here we go with the rest of the army. So now we're going to push into the town hall. We have pulled the CC, so I poisoned that and the king. There we go. Raged him up. Found the tornado. Dropped the jump. Going to go ahead and warden here. The king managed to cut that funnel on the outside. Uh, over here just in time to push all my troops into the core there they go everybody's moving through I'm trying to keep them raged with the healers raged as much as I possibly can there we go the second jump opens up pretty much the rest of the base and I drop the slammer at about two ish o'clock to start picking off defenses Pekka's took a pretty good split. I got two Pekka's in each compartment. Two for the Inferno, two for the Eagle. And both go down about the same time. Now we're just kind of waiting to see what happens next. Those two uh, Pekka's up there are almost no health up here. But they are going to manage to take down that Wizard Tower. So the Slammer actually let the queen out of the base so that's kind of good but um mostly just for cleanup purposes but i did have a ton of balloons so and the peck has made it outside as well and yeah so um i always hit first in these we have a, a batting order so to speak everybody has a time that they have to hit so i'm always one of the first guys to hit and this is one of our first hits of the war so started off really strong let's move down to here next is fox also known as wolf very very good attacker this attack is freaking great i love this raid <laughs> um so he's gonna do the hybrid and i think at first glance a lot of people would think how the heck are you gonna hybrid this because it's not at all like the bases i did tutorials of hybriding on but what he does here, he recognizes something in this base. It's very, very good. Kind of used a lot of balloons there to take down that funnel. <laughs> but he gets it. So now he has a nice uh, funnel established for his queen walk. So he's going to move her up from 3 o'clock into about the 130 position and down into that channel. Place the healers so that if there were any red bombs there that they didn't all get hit by it. And slowly working his way in. So now he's got the king cutting the funnel up there and you can see what he's doing here. If the king and queen are the bread of a sandwich, you see where the meat of this raid is going to take place right he's going right up into those inferno towers and then you notice oh wow the queen can actually reach the town hall from that channel 
So he's going to go ahead and warden here. He's poisoned that baby. Or not yet. I guess he's going to poison that baby. Soon, I hope. <laughs> there it is. All right, so he's got the heal down. Now he's got the slammer down. And that's going to go down and get that Tesla farm for him. Still has a rage. Raged up the hogs. A little late on that freeze. Those hogs probably could have taken down that um, that expo. But it's okay. He's got a ton of hogs coming around the backside here. Really needs that baby to go down. Oh, he those hogs fizzle out, actually. It's going to be the queen, the miners, and the king that clutch this. Here he's going to drop his baby to make sure he takes down the enemy baby. Here we go. Rage up the queen so she can get the expo and the inferno. There we go. And this is looking good. He had, there was a chance to, to mess this up at the end, and he made all the right choices to pull this off. This, this is pretty good. I think things got a little messy for him up there around 9 o'clock, too, with the heels and all that. But, yeah. I think he tried to freeze that hound right when it popped so those pups all wouldn't come out, but it didn't matter. He ended up getting the triple. It was a beautiful raid by Mr. Fox, or Senior Fox. Senior Fox. And the last raid is going to be Captain Clean. Captain Clean has been absolutely cleaning up. I think he's got three triples in a row in this uh, particular league. So he's looking for that MVP 100 bucks. This league, uh, the MVP gets 100 bucks. So if you have the the most triples or the best triples, I guess. I don't know what they do if, if you tie with somebody going perfect. So King's coming down. Brings in the wall wrecker. This this is such a good suey right here. Not a lot of people are suing, uh, doing suey lalo with the wall wrecker like this, and he's a big fan of it. And this works out so well for him. He even brought a valk, but he dropped it too late to get it in here for the the queen kill with the. I imagine it's for skellies or whatever might come out. But here he goes. Queen's coming around. She's gonna go ahead and clean up the queen here the expo the um eagle i don't think she gets that inferno tower i think she gets pulled away by that wizard tower at the bottom or at the right hand side yeah she does but he has really nice lalo pathing here so he's gonna come in about the 11 o'clock and just starts bringing in packs of balloons Takes down that Inferno Tower and the Sweeper. And now he's going to start working on that uh, Wizard Tower. And he's got his main pack of balloons coming in down here. That balloons at the top was just to take down that um, compartment. So now he quakes awake the Town Hall. Rage, freeze, going to warden ability here. Huge pack of balloons. And look at the pathing through that whole area. It's just perfect. Here he goes. Plenty of spells. He's got a heal spell, a free spell, and two haste spells here. What an epic raid. Good stuff, man. Captain Clean. <laughs> we tease this guy a lot, but he is really good. He is really, really good. I'm glad he's on our team. Okay. So that does it for our triples. We're going to go ahead and take a look at the Croatian army triples really quick. And then that will be the video. What do they do on my base in 94? It's pretty good. Pretty good. So here we go. Uh, an anti-2 style base from Captain E-Rock here. And I'm going to go ahead and times 2 this because it is spam bowlers and witches. Now, <laughs> I mean, say what you want about the spam bowlers and witches it is really strong against the anti twos no doubt and this guy didn't just spam them in a line he did kind of cut funnels i mean you can make the argument that this is a spam raid but you know i could care less 
if anybody's spamming or not. If you're getting triples, that's all that really matters. So here he comes, making that push to the town hall, which is moving through. He's got the jump spell to let them out the back of the town hall compartment with the bowlers and witches and the queen and the uh, warden there. Oh, the king is in there too, just now uses ability. Whenever you're at the back end of a base, you have both hero abilities, it's almost always a triple. So here he goes, queen gets stuck on a wall, as the queen does. <laughs> uh, just basically clean up. I mean, it's not a whole lot of troops left, but just enough to pull this off. And the thing about this raid is he pushed through the base so fast he had all this time for cleanup on the back end. That's crazy. But good raid from Salty. Got Captain Erock, and then Lek got grabbed by... How do I pronounce that? Relja? I don't know. But this, uh, this Sui is OP right here. So he's going to cut the funnel with a baby drag and a bowler. Now what he wants to do is suey this inferno and get the queen. So note to all you base building kids out there, aspiring base builders, do not put your queen next to an inferno that can be sueyed. It's just too much value, right? Um, he didn't even bring his king in on this either. So just the queen. Queen and ice golem, some wall breakers, and funnel troops. And he gets... The Inferno and the Queen. So now he's got the E-Drag to cut the other side of this funnel. Or A side of this funnel. And then he's going to put his King down here to funnel this side. And Dragon's up the middle to go for that Inferno and the Town Hall. There we go. Uh, Stone Slammer to tank. Handful of balloons to catch any Sams. Here they go. That king is doing a great job funneling down there. Does pull the CC, has a poison. And he has bats. And if you look, there's no splash up here at all. There's two down here. But uh, you get the pathing right on those dragons and they'll tank for you all day. So down goes the town hall. And there he goes with the bat bomb. He put an ice comb down here to distract that wizard tower. Dragons are distracting that wizard tower, which is dead. And yeah, this base is crushed. Just like that. Beautiful raid. Croatian army. GG, you guys are tough. Really tough. We, uh, we weren't sure how this was going to turn out. And we're very grateful that we pulled off this win. But yeah. Croatian Army, they are very, very tough. GG to them. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. This was match number two of three, and we're undefeated, so I think we're guaranteed the playoffs at this point no matter what. But we play Secret Alliance in the next one. Hopefully we'll pull off that War two and we can go undefeated for the season. Anyways, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one.